Hi everybody. So as you can tell by the scruff on my face, it's no shave November. Uh, so uh, I'm not shaving. <laughs> anyway, uh, the Aji lemon drop peppers. I've been fermenting them in this giant bowl. I'm gonna process these down. Um, and I'm gonna try some different recipes with the base of the lemon pepper. It has a very fruity smell as you open it up. Of course, the, the nice sour smell of the ferment that my wife does not care for. <laughs> but I thought I'd put some with uh, some, try some maraschino cherries in one, got some mango for other. I've got orange juice, lemon zest, and, and ginger. My idea is to make things that would go good with chicken. That's the dish I'm targeting. So we're gonna try it tomorrow with some uh, drumsticks um, and, and put a glaze on them, probably blend it into like a honey butter glazing sauce once the sauce is, is done. So we'll see how that works. Um, I'm really excited to try this and see how the flavors come out. So we're gonna do some experimenting, see what flavors work. All right. So bending up the base, we've got three quarts of that base plus these other uh, flavor tested. This is just plain, it's just a ferment with the peppers, sauce, there's not even any vinegar, it's just the brine. This has got uh, obviously some of the maraschino cherries, the color is rather interesting, and some of the dried mangoes. Um, I think I added a little bit of salt uh, and a little bit of vinegar. The, this is a light vinegar. Silver Swan, it's not, uh, it doesn't add a lot to the flavor, it just kind of keeps the pH where it should be. This is orange juice, ginger, lemon zest, orange zest, and some honey, which was given to us by a friend of ours. Uh, they had it on their uh, farm. Schnapp Apri, it says, wildflower honey. So it's made here in Missouri. And I uh, put a third of a cup, might be a quarter. Yeah, uh, in there. So I poured out little bowls for us to try. So here's your spoon. Thanks, dog. I don't know which one to start with. I think I'm going to start with the base. And then there's a cup to rinse your spoons here. So. Alright, here we go. So, got, got a little bit of heat. Not a lot, uh, pretty tolerable. You said that has lemon in it, right? Lemon zest, orange zest, orange juice, and honey, ginger. I definitely, definitely taste the lemon though. And then garlic, wait, did it have any garlic? Or no? no garlic. What is that, what am I tasting? No. no, not really. That's a lot of pulp, probably have to screen it. I can't do it. It's ginger. Ginger on there. Dirty pig. Yeah. Well, rinse it however you want. Well, I'm just going to make more dishes. I can't. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah. Use a new spoon. I'll just try the middle. Have you tried the middle yet? Not yet. Thank no. you. Thank goodness. <laughs> How's that taste? That is weird. That's sweet. It's sweet. Yeah, the mango. They put Melissa wrong. That is very sweet. Yeah, that's really sweet. That's what I'm saying. That's surprisingly sweet. Pretty good though. It's all right, yeah. This one has a lot of the ginger flavor. I think I like that. Are you? Keeping I definitely it? like that. Are you keeping it at the thicknesses? All of them? Or I haven't put any xanthan gum in to make it thick. I haven't strained it. I haven't done okay. anything but overall flavor. Uh, this would go good with chicken, yeah. I think yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. So these are hot wing bound, and it's not very hot. I mean, it's it's got a nice. Uh, bite to it but uh it's not gonna kill your heat so kind of like it you go ahead and stop